Here we are. Grab a rake. Sort out those seed beds. Once this place is straightened out, you can run around and play. Or whatever it is kids do nowadays. I remember back in the day, uh, yeah, whatever. When you're done, find me in the house. We have to decide what to do with that package. Yeah, Grandpa, here's a package for you. Ah, the seeds. You say Nadine? Thank you. Now, go do some work. Ooh, aw. Oh. That's... Rather rake the ground with this over my bare hands. Okay. No, Chester, you could help. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Interact. Greetings, Baron Von Seedbed. Ha <laughs> ha. Intelligence? Nope, charm. Boom, level up. That'll help. Well, that's it. All done. Ah, you think. Ah, you came. Sure, I'm always happy to help. Let's get started. Wow, those are some nice seed beds. Good start. If you'll need seeds, I brought some with me. Here, take them. Put those seeds in the ground and cover them up. Also, need to decide whether to fertilize the soil. Fertilizer dramatically improves the results of your labor. Give it a try. Grab some fertilizer and choose which garden bed you'll be after. So it's not that. Okay. Oh. Get him. Oh, I only had the one. All right. He seized it. All right. So she just gave me two seeds. Move it, Chester. Looking good. Now, because the important part, you have to water your plants regularly or the wither before you, before you out, go out to do something in the town. Always remember to water your garden. Gotta go. That was fun. Thanks a bunch. Have a nice day. Let's go. Oh, you youngsters finished already? Yes, Grandpa, just like you wanted. That'll do. Here, for your help. Your grandfather is no cheapskate. Now, oh, this place is growing on. I just remember. I could use half a dozen dandelions for my wine. There's plenty of them in the wildland. Local kids hang out there. Maybe you'll make some friends. Have some fun. Wildland is at the end of the street. Just go east and don't take any turns. No, no, no. We're going to go get Chester some candy. He, he needs stuff. Uh, yeah, this one. All right. Uh, bye. So we can get a gummy bear for 12... Licorice. Wow. All right, so let's get him a gummy bear. Here you go. Sweet tooth. Oh, yeah. Candies. Cool. Sweet. Chester got his candy. Well, we're going to make sure Chester got his candy. Uh, where was the pawn shop? Uh, yeah. 
Oh, tab. I thought it was. All right, so we got uh, let's see, workout, cleaning, reading, gardening, crafting, small set. Oh, so, okay. So it's that'll be closed until we see, I guess, Grandpa's friend, Mister Lovell. I think he ran the runs the place. That's something I didn't. I said okay to it, but we never actually went and checked it out. It's a great day for gardening today. Any more advice for me? Don't add more than one fertilizer at a time. Kill the plant. It'd be difficult to find a less suitable place for flamingo. See anything back here? Thing going on in the playground? Oh yeah, you. I can't interact with you yet. He, I remember they, well, can we trigger it? Yeah, let's go ahead and trigger this event. There it is. Baseball field, somewhat abandoned. Be cool to go there with one of my friends. If I could figure out how to get in there. There you you want to play there? I'm sorry to disappoint you. Field is closed. Though I never thought that a girl would be interested in baseball. Uh, I never thought boys couldn't open doors. Try it yourself. It's hard to open a door when it's locked. You could dig a hole or chew through the wire if you really wanted to get there. So, what are you doing here? Why's the why's the field locked up? There's not even anything to steal. Maybe or many years ago, there was several disappearances of children from this field. Couldn't find the perpetrators, so they just decided to lock up the field. Surprisingly, it worked. It was only this year that people started disappearing again. Hmm. Uh, I'm just passing through or can we escape out of here now? I'm just passing through. Maybe I want to play baseball. Why do you care? You help me open the baseball field. I'd be happy to play with you. I'll even give you my old bat. Just please help me open it. Please. You'll see. I'll try to find the key. If I have time, I live nearby. As soon as you open the field, I'll be right here. All right. Time to open will come someday. That's for sure. Yup, yup, yup. I think, uh, one of these was, uh, well, they, I don't know if they called her a witch or what she was considered. Look, there are plenty of them here. You know, this is actually kind of relaxing. Hey, have you seen a girl around here? Our age, brown hair? Uh, let's, let's show off our smarts. Let's ask about her. Now, of course, we missed. Where'd your friend disappear to? Don't be silly, Emily. If I knew that, would have found her by now. Will you help us find her? We're going to help him, right, Emily? Uh, what will we get? Oh, maybe we'll accept you into our pack. We'll see. We'll help, but we're not from here. What's the story around here? There's a forest to the north. To the west, there's a runoff ditch. 
There's the tree house to the east, and to the south is town. That's where you came from. Uh, why should we help you? She's not our friend. Hey, what's wrong with you? Want to spend the whole summer cleaning our rooms and picking dandelions? I think you're right. All right, tell us about the place. Where should we start looking? All right, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, got it. I'll tell you if I find anything. It's finally starting to feel like an adventure. But I hang out with these guys. All right, I'll have a look around by myself. I'll tell you if I find anything. All right, he's going to check the woods. You're going to the creek. You're going over there. And you're going to the woods too. All right. All right. I think anyone other than Grandpa needs these flowers. Yeah, but I got an extra just in case. Can I? Ooh. I could talk to the first kid, but I'm getting apples. Ooh, what's this? What is that on the roof? It's some kind of riddle. There's a log in a field that you've already found. Next, find a rock. Have a good look around. Or just try diagonal left from the bird's eye view. Maybe check over there for a prize fit for you. Wow, real tree house. Just like in the photo I found? People who built it must have grown up already. So it belongs to everyone now. We can hang out there and not be afraid of anything. No, I don't. Can I have the sticks? No. All right. There are a lot of teddy bears around here. Padlock. Mm. Let's go with... It's the same either way. Let's go with smarts. Bam. I was the person who was trying to hide the key. Where'd I put it? I'd put it in the hole down. By the house? That's too easy. Under a rock somewhere. Or a hollow tree. Uh, let's try... My proficiency. Let's try breaking. Ooh. I like so flimsy. Give me the right fulcrum and I could open the door. Oh, that was smarts too? All right. Oh, I got, ooh, wow, what a sword. Folks around here play some cool games. I'm the one who found the key, so now the thing is mine. Okay, so if I, as long as I get in, it still pretends like I got the key. Ah, there's something else. A neat little whistle? Hmm, should I blow this whistle? Yes. Oh, forgot about this. What the hell? It's so dark. Where am I? Is this a secret passage? Am I inside the tree? No, it doesn't seem like it. I need to get out of here. Uh, we could take a little bit of a step. Don't come any closer. Ah. What else we got in here? No, 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 no. Stay away from me. Uh, one shot. What the heck? Just a dream. Just a dream. Dreams looking at you, Emily. The hell? 
Hello, Emily. You're a long way from home. I must confess, you played quite a trick on that demon. Hats off. Uh, where am I? Oh, wait. Are you real? I'd pinch you, but I wouldn't want to leave you ravaged. Of course I'm real. Didn't you feel real fear during your fight? Yeah, I did. That's the best proof you'll ever get. Fear never lies. Uh, where the hell am I? Let me go home. You're on the underside. Layer of reality inhabited by demons. Nearly even found the missing girl. And who were those disappearing twins? Those are tricks the demons use to lure people into their traps. So anybody can accidentally wind up here? Precisely. That's why you have to sign the contract and protect the innocent. Uh, about the contract you're rather lucky that little demon was such a weakling and it was alone It'd be rather imprudent of me to lose such a capable protege so i shall offer the contract once again for you to sign hmm then i want to get paid Can you Unique power isn't enough for you, an adventure that others could hardly even dream of? That's not enough for you? Mm. No, that, that that's enough. All right, it's a deal. That's right. Truth be told, you never really had much of a choice. Probably better than just dying here. So, what's going to happen anyway? I mean, how do I know what to do with this demon guardian? You'll feel it in times of danger. New abilities will open to you. But you must learn to control these powers. And now it's time for you to go and save the girl. All right, now I got to remember where she gets off to. There we go. Wait, you, you really are real, aren't you? Wait. I don't believe you. No, you're not real. Oh, uh, mm, don't mind me. I was just leaving. But can I get that treasure chest before I, I go? What luck. We have everything ready for you. Don't be afraid, dearie. You'll be warm and comfortable and it's no trouble at all. Bring her to. Demon? Demon. Oh. Oh. Right. So, you have a guardian. Think that will save you? I have to think about it. Uh, want to flip a coin? What coin? I'm out of here. What the? Who are you? Oh, my head. Where'd you come from? Uh, the tree house, obviously. What are we doing up there anyway? That place is old. They say there's ghosts. They're right. Mm. Sorry. Let, let me, let's introduce ourselves first. I didn't introduce myself. The name's Emily. Nice to meet you. I'm Ramona. That's Chester. Emily, that wasn't funny. We were looking for one girl and we lost another. Uh, actually, I think I found her. But the demons caught her. There were too many of them. You should have taken me with you. I'd have run them off. Uh, man, I'm right here. Why are you worried? 
Seriously? I don't even care why. Just tell me where. Where were you hiding? She was in the treehouse. Rescue rangers. But I looked through the window. I did a little squirt like you reach the window. Climbing on a bra. Hmm. I'm not a squirrel. That's enough, Ramona. The joke is over his head. Uh, to... I guess we got to do this one now. To find a missing girl, you need to think like one. You need to become one. Dang it. If you keep laughing at me, next time I won't spend the whole day looking for you. Listen, sorry to interrupt your family reunion, but I need to get going. Frank will shout my ear off if I'm late. He'll walk you home. I'm the one who held you up after all. Great. Let's hurry up then. Ramona, this is the eighth time you've been past curfew in the last three months. It's nearly dark out. Didn't I tell you to be home by 8 p.m.? Sharp? Sorry, Frank, it won't happen again. It's our fault. We, we got lost and she said she'd show us the way. You're not from around here, are you? I haven't seen you kids before. Where'd you come from? Where do you live? I don't know, Cotton Eye Joe. We're from Chicago. We're here to visit Grandpa Cooper. Oh, I see. Cooper lives down the street. In case you're still lost, people have been disappearing around here. So on behalf of the state police, I recommend you not stay on the street for too long after dark. Now get home. Bye, Ramona. Uh, the, the, that person's suspicious, officer. Let's go for a run. It's already dark. All right, let's do it. Kids go pick dandelions in a neighboring state. Everyone should be home at 10 p.m. Good night. What are you still doing here? Well, the dandelions. Give them to me. Here, this is for the trouble. I'll forget to give it to you by tomorrow. I go to sleep. Don't be like life. Don't be late like that again. 20 whole cents. I'll get you more dandelions each day if that's what I get. All right, Grandpa. Good night. Wait, I thought he wanted 10. Hmm. This where we meet Mr. Lovell? Nope. Hello? Hi, Emily. This is Ramona. Remember me? Gravitational forces introduced us yesterday. Oh, hi, Ramona. Of course. Yesterday, you told me you saw a ghost in that treehouse. And I just wanted to say, well, basically, if you want to learn more about it, then we could go to the library. I saw an old book there. About curses, ghosts, demons, all that devil stuff, you know. Mm, you're right. I should find out what's going on. Mind keeping me company? Yeah, I'd love to. I was just on my way there anyway. But I'll have to meet you there. Ask your grandpa for directions. He'll explain it better than me. I'll be waiting for you at the spot. When should we meet? Let's say... Hour? Okay. Got it. What's that all about? Somebody calls my house and it's not even for me. What a life. There's Ramona. She's a girl from the neighborhood. I know who she is. She's Frank's kid. Our local champion of justice. You met her already? Yeah, yesterday when we went to pick dandelions. We met some local kids. Uh-huh. All right. You going for a walk with her? To the library. Oh, don't give Grandpa any of that nonsense. There's no way to get a kid in the library, especially in the summer. Telling the truth. Actually, I like books more than people. Well, maybe you really are my granddaughter. Come home when you're done at the library. Today marks the third day of the ongoing police search for Sarah Westfield, the missing local girl seen at the park. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Nope, nope, nope. We gotta, we gotta water. Do I need to go back, go to the library, rock and roll? Okay. I just, I wanted to make sure. So yeah, these are unlocked, but not yet. Guardian D. All right. I have to ask grandpa where the library is. Ah, left. Right. Here on. Go ahead and cross here. Pick anything in here. Solve the crossword. I don't think anyone would mind if I worked on this crossword puzzle a little. Which iconic figures associated with women supporting the defense industry during World War II? That was easy. Rosie the Riveter. Oh yeah, that's it. Betty Boop. Oh, that was a good shot. Can do it again. Navajo style. Cute. Picnic. Nice place. I want to come here with someone sometime. Oh, we got date night. What a beauty. A true eagle. Well, figuratively speaking, of course. Feed the swan. Sorry, I don't have anything for you right now. All right. Is that? Kitty. Can't do anything with a kitty. It's a point that you can only buy in stores. Come to the pawn shop. Take the western exit from the park. Here you can sell your junk at a fair price. Little girl, Sarah Westfield has been reported missing. Yeah, we know about her. All right. Talk to the old man. <clears throat> Hello. Hello. Uh, please tell me, do you happen to have the old key to the baseball field? Oh, baseball. You really, you kids really aren't scared of what they'll say about that field. What's wrong with the field? There's definitely something wrong. Children disappear and died there. There's nothing for you to do there. Police never found the ones who did it, and we locked up the field. Peterson's got the key. They're the ones that live closest to the field. Seems like it's quiet enough there now. Maybe. Anyway, if Peterson is in his right mind, he'll never give you the key. That field is... There's something wrong with that place. Sorry, I didn't mean to bother you. Kind of penguin? Gummy bear. I could have got him ice cream for a penny cheaper. Ah, Chester. What the hell is that? Oh, touch it with a stick. I guess I won't be touching it with a stick. Cinema Jim, oh, can I go in? It's the first time you come here, right? No, I mean yes. I mean uh right. This is my first time here. It's great that you finally come to correct your oversight. 